Yeah. I'll tell you what, after a while, when it's been running, it looks like that. It looks good, yeah. We keep it clean every day and it gets dirty every day, so. There's lots more modern stuff, air brakes and uh, electronics. I should ask this guy he knows I'm the uh, I'm the con here because I'm I'm for Great Central Railway, I'm just helping out. Oh right. But, <laughs> but the air brake certainly works on the original. So which is the air brake is it? This one. Well this yeah. is that's the air brake for the locomotive itself. Yeah. That's the air brake, 130 PSI. Right. You can hear the you hear the pump? Yes. Often, that's yes. keeping that 130 PSI. So, well, I think all all the mainline oh, locomotives yes. have that. Yes. Yes. But the old days are different. But the uh, the controller here is when you, sort it out. that's the locomotive yeah, it's Oh, there we are. That's when what you get the train behind. This is the, the this is what this is, this is what it runs on. Forget <laughs> coal and water. <laughs> tea. No tea. No no engine. The other controls are pretty much as it would have been. Just the same regulator. Apart from that, as uh, Peter said, which would have had the vacuum brake here like the A4. Is everything is the same. We got that gauge, which would have had those two uh, pumps over there. They're the lubricators on the air pumps. Yeah. 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 All the time that goes, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Ye